Hey guys, this is Ghost Hunter Dan, Larry behind the camera. We got a new set of dowsing rods we're going to try out. Now, before we start, these are ball bearing copper rods. Okay? They're a little tight, but they swing. So there's, I want to show you, there's no way that I can manipulate these that was brought up in a previous video that's why I'm making a big deal out of it so here we go we're gonna try to talk to John Campbell John if you're here cross the rods for yes move them apart for no okay straighten them back out please I just want to point out that more than likely the microphone's picking up the wind yeah. and you're still getting controlled responses. And the wind's blowing like right at me or right from the side. So technically the rod should be blowing to the right, but yet they're straight out. And turn it one turning towards one's the wind. Turning towards the wind. Yeah. John, are you stuck here? Move them apart for no, move them together for yes, or cross them for yes. Are you stuck here? Can you move them farther so that we have a confirmation that you're not stuck here? Okay. All right, straighten them back out. Did you only come here because I called you? Whoa, my hands are shaking now. You see them shaking? Okay, sorry about that. Let me shake these out, guys. They're also brand new rods. They're brand new rods, so they're not. It's hard to get tuned to them when you're used to using another one. Okay. <clears throat> John, I went to the site where the two Driscolls were executed for your assassination. The older, the oldest Driscoll uh, told me he feels remorse for what he did. Do you believe him? Cross it for yes, move them apart for no. Do you believe he's remorseful? Okay. All right. John, there's in your own home in your old homestead is a stone where you fell after you were shot. Did you die right away? Yes, you crashed. Okay. Were the two men that they executed responsible for your murder? Move them apart for no. Move them together for yes, or cross them for yes. Why do I keep saying move them again? I think I'd never done this before. Okay. Which I want to say historically is the thought. The guys that shot him were one of the Driscoll boys and a friend of the gangs. But the father and one of the brothers are the ones who were executed for this. John, I'm not going to keep you too much longer, and I do appreciate you coming and talking to us, sir. And um, would you like me to come out and talk to you again sometime? I just really like to do some more research before I really... Okay. I will do that, sir. I'd really like to do some more research so I can ask you some more pertinent questions. So thank you for talking to us. So, guys... Communicated with John Campbell. Um, pretty much from the history that I have studied about this, he confirmed what it, what uh, everybody says. So, but he also didn't think the one guy was remorseful. No, no. Um, the Prairie Bandits uh, burned down the Ogle County Courthouse. They raised a whole lot of ruckus in Ogle and DeKalb County, and. Uh, 
they were incidentally the the dad and one of the boys were executed here in Ogle County by a group of 500 people they basically tried them in a field and loaded up and and executed them the day after this happened so uh, Larry and I'll go to that later in the spring um, when it's not so wet out and we'll see if we can get the Driscoll boys to talk to us anyway guys this is Ghost Hunter Dan Larry behind the camera and we'll see you guys in the next one